How come we can't just keep regrowing teeth? Because flossing is lame, you know? Anthony here, and JK, you guys, I floss occasionally. You know, taking care of your teeth is an important thing to us humans because you only get one adult set, but why? You know, most vertebrates can actually replace their teeth over and over again until they die. I'm a vertebrate, I want equal tooth rights. It seems unfair when sharks can grow 30,000 teeth in their lifetime, alligators can regenerate a lost tooth up to 50 times. And while there aren't a lot of immediately recognizable similarities between us and alligators, their teeth are actually super similar to ours. Their adult teeth are in sockets of their dental bone, just like ours. They have very well-organized teeth that have different functions, just like ours. The big difference researchers have just found is that under every adult tooth, they have another baby tooth, and then under that baby tooth, they've got these sort of stem cell proto-teeth. So they lose an adult tooth, and the baby tooth morphs into an adult one, and the stem cells turn into a baby one. Lucky. So what makes that happen? See, regeneration is pretty common throughout animals. You cut a tail off a lizard or an arm off a starfish and they grow back. It even happens a bit in humans. If a fetus loses a body part, it grows right back. If a two-year-old loses a fingertip, there's a good chance that that's gonna come back. But after around age five, that ability is totally gone. So what makes it go away? Well, more primitive animals are just more robust and simple. They're just built to be tanks and they have a lot of regenerative power. Fewer systems, more raw stem cells to rebuild them. Somewhere along the lines of human evolution, we built more specialized and complex systems. Now the downside to all that amazing complexity is that we have fewer stem cells than other animals. No stem cells, no crazy arm regrowing, no infinite teeth. But here's what's rad. Those researchers didn't just figure out alligator teeth for the fun of it, they took a look at the alligator DNA, compared it to our own, and found that the regenerative code that kids have, it's still there, it's just switched off. So in the future, we could potentially switch that code back on, and then in combination with a little stem cell therapy, help people regrow teeth or missing body parts, or turn us into crazed lizard men. It's like 50-50 which one of those is gonna happen. I wish I could grow a new set of teeth, because I never wore my retainer when I was a kid and I would really like another chance at some straight ones. Anything you'd like a second chance at regenerating? Let me know down below and subscribe for more D-News.